Ken Block, a man who conquered the realms of skateboarding, snowboarding, and motocross, leaving his mark wherever he went. If you haven't heard the name before, where have you been hiding? He was an American prolific rally driver who died in a snowmobile crash. But the question is, how could a man so skilled in motorsports meet such a tragic fate? Moreover, why did no one step forward to offer assistance in his time of need? Join us to unravel the untold tale of Ken Block's fatal snowmobile crash. His full name was Kenneth Paul Block, who was born on November 21, 1967. With a passion for action sports, he wasn't your average Joe behind the wheel, he was truly a risk taker. In 2005, he kicked off his rallying career, leaving his competitors in the dust. Within just two years, he was making appearances in the World Rally Championship. Oh, and did I mention that Ken Block was also one of the masterminds behind the iconic DC shoes? Yep, he was burning rubber on the track and shaping the fashion industry at the same time. A true pioneer, if you ask me. And to top it all off, Ford, an American multinational automobile manufacturer, couldn't resist the allure of Ken's talent and charm. In 2010, they signed him up to drive for the Monster World Rally Team. When he got the opportunity, he eagerly hopped on board the Global Rally Cross Championship, joining the team now famously known as Hoonigan Racing Division. After selling his ownership of DC Shoes, Block cleverly shifted gears and steered his business focus towards Hoonigan Industries, an apparel brand for auto enthusiasts. He became the co-owner and the witty head Hoonigan in charge, also known as HHIC, at the company before his death in a snowmobile accident in January 2023. Ken even had the silver medal from the Global Rally Cross Championship in 2015. But Mr. Block didn't just settle for silver, he strapped himself into the FIA World Rally Cross Championship the following year, ready to take on the world. But you might find yourself wondering, didn't I see Ken in those Jim Connor videos, fearlessly stunting and flaunting his moves? Actually, you are right. The real secret behind his global stardom was his Jim Connor videos. These viral sensations took the internet by storm, leaving viewers craving more. Believe it or not, these Jim Connor videos have collected 500 million views. That's more views than the population of some countries. But with Ken Block's vast expertise in driving and stunting, the burning question arises. What on earth happened on that fateful day of January 2, 2023? Well, it was found that just before the accident, Block was in Utah spending holiday with his family, enjoying the snowy scenery and sharing his excitement on social media. Look at this posted picture and videos of himself with a group of snowmobiles all set for an exciting ride. Shortly before his passing, Block couldn't contain his excitement and shared his joy online. He wrote, It's been snowing a lot in Park City, Utah this week, with more snow expected for the weekend. He thanked Skidoo Sleds and Kubota USA Machinery for clearing the way, looking forward to the fresh snow that was coming. On January 2, 2023, the Wasatch County Sheriff's Office received a call about a snowmobile accident around 2 p.m. Search and rescue teams, along with other authorities, rushed to the scene to help. The news that followed was devastating. In a Facebook post, the Sheriff's Office announced, Kenneth Block, a 55-year-old man from Park City, Utah, was riding a snowmobile on a steep slope when something went wrong. The snowmobile flipped over, landing on top of him. Despite efforts to save him, Block sadly passed away from the injuries he sustained. But what makes this even more heartbreaking is that Block was riding with a group, enjoying their time together. But during the accident, he was alone and faced this tragedy without anyone by his side. The loss of Ken Block shocked the racing community. The news hit us like a punch to the gut. Hoonigan Racing, Ken Block's own team, took to Instagram to deliver the devastating news on Monday. They wrote, It's with our deepest regrets that we can confirm that Ken Block passed away in a snowmobile accident today. Ken was a visionary, a pioneer, and an icon, and most importantly, a father and husband. He will be incredibly missed. Please respect the family's privacy at this time while they grieve. But mere hours before his passing, Ken posted on Instagram about his daughter. He wrote, the fourth and final episode of my 16-year-old daughter Leah buying, tearing down, rebuilding and now driving her 85 Audi UR Quattro will be live at 8 a.m. PST tomorrow on my YouTube channel. Will her newly refinished vintage Audi finally do a donut? 
While Block's majority of posts have been flooded with tribute and goodbye messages from fans and followers worldwide, this last post about his daughter's upcoming video has attracted the most comments. At last, as we remember Ken Block's legacy, what do you believe was his most iconic moment or stunt? Share your personal favorite in the comments section.